Hey everybody, this is Joe from Joe's Premium Firewood, I'm bringing you another educational video. Um, today's video, I am going to show you how to make a bundle of. Okay, I already got my operation set up and have been going for a little while. Um, first thing you're going to need is some uh, seasoned Joe's Premium Firewood. That's some nice maple and uh, oak in there, red oak. And then I've already got these uh, strings already pre-cut to about six feet long. I set them here on the three of them on the tailgate, and then uh, tie them up, or set you know then set seven pieces, seven to ten pieces of wood on it, and then tie it up. And then I uh, put it here in my quad trailer, and then take it down the road or down the driveway to my uh, roadside stand. So I'll uh, do one here real quick. I hope to. This doesn't stop recording when I set it down here and that the autofocus kicks in. Okay, as I said, uh, take three of these strings and lay them across the tailgate. Wind start to pick up. I hope that it doesn't they don't blow off. Usually space them about three inches apart. There you go. And it usually takes about the whole length of the tailgate. Now I gotta build a little pyramid here of uh, some wood. There's an oak, maple. Those are big pieces, so I'm only gonna go with probably six or seven pieces on this. But if they're smaller pieces, I add more pieces to it. Piece couple pieces of cherry or a piece of cherry here and more oak. And I think we'll cap it off with a piece of maple. I don't like putting too much on there because uh you know, I don't know if old ladies or whatever are picking up the wood and oak's really heavy so try not to do too much about 15 20 pounds on average usually tie the center one first I just do a square knot and make sure it's good and tight sometimes they shift around here and I don't want them to get loose you know I started out putting just two on but if one of them breaks then the thing falls apart and I've had that some of these edges here are sharp causes this and if it rubs on it, it causes the string to break and one more There, that should be pretty good. Then I just grab the two outside ones, let it get adjusted, shift around in there, and as you can see, you know, decent size of, you know, bundle of wood. As good as what they got in the stores at half the price, so how can you beat that? Put it in the trailer and repeat, repeat the process again. Well, that concludes today's video. I hope you enjoyed it.